Uh, guys, uh, Four Toad Legend. That's what I'm going to be calling myself now because that's my new character name for the review. Now I'm just going to get right down to it. Here is the sixth installment of the WTF Resident Evil series. This episode I'm talking about the Convenience of the series, which many of the fans should be aware of. And I'm just going to get right down to the downright implausibility of the entire series in general. One of the most notable, and I believe, at least this is what I believe is the most notable of implausibility and conveniencies, would be in Resident Evil 3 when Jill is fighting Nemesis and becomes infected with the T-Virus, leaving a mercenary with little to no experience in the field of medicine to create a cure to a disease that would take scientists decades, if not uh, about nine years, to create. So almost if not more than a decade to cure this disease and a mercenary with at least first aid experience is able to cure it in 10 minutes. I don't know. I just believe that, you know, seeing as how it takes scientists to create decades to cure diseases and many of which are still incurable to this day, I don't know. I don't believe that someone can cure a disease like the T-Virus in roughly 10 minutes, which is what it takes me when I'm playing through it. But, regardless, he still cures the disease all by himself and in a very short amount of time. And instead of documenting the procedures to cure the disease, he feels better. Or, like, even creating multiple samples in case he becomes infected. Or, you know, that way you can also give your findings if you actually get out of the series. No, it makes more sense to just give it away to the one person who's infected. Never thinking that you might need the findings or multiple samples and never even thinks that long term effects like saving billions of people if the infection ever got out of the city or the fact that he can actually make billions just by selling the patent alone no that, do that doesn't occur to him because I guess the writers just wrote themselves in a corner and just decided oh screw it we don't actually need to think we, we'll just ship it out it's okay or in Jill, Resident Evil 1 where Barry just happens to have this lockpick when lock Jill's a master of unlocking and you're still carrying around more lockpicks than a fuck I mean more Maybe keys I'll than a fucking it. high school janitor but you know or like uh see or like the fact that I don't know why not make it more realistic and instead of making happens, summing something up in five up seconds in you can actually stress the story out a bit and actually explain things I mean, isn't that much to ask to, to make a more realistic game so that way it's more scary? I mean, 